We're in Internet Information Services on a Windows 2019 server, and I'm going to show you how to change or edit permissions. So if we take the default website, for instance, and right-click, there's an option here to edit permissions. So if you can't get in anonymously, it could be a couple of different reasons. If we click on Security, you should see the option here for IIS I users. And what that is, is that's a special user that was created when you installed IIS. Now, if you missed that part or need to know how to do that, there's another video in this playlist that shows you how to do that. Now, take a look at the rights. You have read and execute, list folder contents, and read. That basically just allows any anonymous user to go in and just check out the site. They can't make any changes to it. However, if we click Edit, and we can have the option here to give additional rights to anonymous users, which is not a good idea. Or you can give additional rights to local users. So I can go in and click Add, type in Domain Users. So that's anybody inside your Active Directory domain. And we can give them as many rights as we want or give them full control. And if we decide we don't want them to have control, we could give them the deny access, which trumps any types of rights. So we click apply to that, apply. So anonymous users will still only have the read-only access, but all domain users will have full access to the data.